is up, guys. Welcome back to Rob Squad Reactions with your boy Jay. And your girl Amber. And we are back today with not just any reaction video, guys. Today is Female Friday. Female Friday, one of our favorite days here on the channel. Today that we bring light to the amazing female artists. But before we get started, tell them what they need to do. Guys, go ahead and like this video, subscribe to our channel, and turn on that post notification bell so you don't miss anything that we've got coming. That's because we don't drop just one or two videos a day, guys. We drop three videos a day. Every single day. So if you hit that post notification bell, you will not miss a video. And we promise y'all. Don't want to miss a video. You don't want to do it. So come join the RSR family. As we always say, the best family, the best subscribers on all of YouTube. But it's Female Friday. Y'all know your boy Jay has no idea what we're listening to. Mama makes me turn around and she pulls it all up. What do we got today? Some 90s grunge female band when I saw that. 90s, y'all know I love me yes, some 90s grunge. Yes, and we grunge, have not really a seen 90s. a female band of 90s grunge. So mm. today we're listening to The Breeders and the song is Cannonball. We have not reacted to The Breeders. So brand new, ring that new artist bell. <laughs> I couldn't do it before because I had no idea who we were listening to. The Breeders, and what was the song? Cannonball. Cannonball. Let's go ahead and check it out. Again, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Let's go. We're only admitting this song, and there's so much to talk about. Like, all the different aspects, the the person with the mouth in the water, the humming, then he brought a whistle the, out. The, the, the ooh, ooh the part, I like it, cool it's creepy. sounds. And, like, here, like, we were actually doing a couple songs. So we were actually one the other day, and I think it actually got blocked. But, like, when they come in at the very beginning of the song with that bass guitar, mm -hmm. ooh, it just sounds so, so good. Absolutely. But, no, I'm, I'm definitely digging the sound so far, and it's very... I'd say unique. I'm going to call this artistic. Um, I really... Uh, no, it's, artistic. it's artistic. I like the uh, the ooh part mm. that they're doing. I'm not even going to attempt <laughs> it, but I like like the mm. eeriness almost to it. But then the way that they're showing you in the video, almost how they're implementing these sounds, and then how they drop everything off and you hear that sound for a moment, Like I think it's really cool. I think a lot of times, just in that first minute, you got so many different sounds, you could almost see how they implemented them and it was really, and did really you see artistic. The drummer, instead of hitting like the hi hat deal, he hit the the stand. Yeah, yeah, the stand, that's that's so that a cool. great example. Let's get back. Right there. 
Okay, real quick, uh, that riff that we're hearing right now, the, that kind of makes that one part. Where oh, just... Yeah, that kind of makes me just want to go with it. But uh, it was mentioned that the t the two ladies that are singing are their twin sisters from Ohio, I believe, or the mm. band's from Ohio. But I really think you could. It's cool when they do sing together because mm. almost as twins, they are super in unison and they Ooh. have like a a tone. It's like mellow. It's really mellow, and it's mm. not something you hear from a lot of like other artists, right. their, their tone that they have mm -hmm. and the fact that they both kind of have it and they come in together in mm -hmm. an amazing unison is really cool. Let's go ahead and get back. Of course they would end it like that, like with a drop, because they drop right. it and pick us up so many times. That's cool. I like how they've kind of kept that going until the very end. Okay, so for Cannonball, my favorite part about them is their composition and their, how artistic they really put, how, how much artistic expression, I would say, they really put into that song. No, no doubt Not about Not Cannonball, the breeders, I'm sorry. Yeah, no doubt about The only thing, I, I, I wish I could have heard more of their voices the in this. It, honestly, the vocals. I feel like uh, the the sound was, yeah. was was over the top. And it may be just, uh, but that was the official video. But I, I want to hear more from them, for sure. Because their voices um, were really cool. Uh, it, that's right. The, the verses were cool, and they were mellow. But to me, the, the, the instruments kind you of You could hear as much. You, you wanted to hear more I, yeah, of I want to hear more of their vocals. Because they're pretty, exactly. absolutely. So please drop down the comments. Give us some more of that but they're definitely unique yeah. also, as we mentioned like the, the art they went with it the different little tricks and like necks tricks that they do, yeah but was, was super cool so I, I definitely enjoyed that aspect of yeah it. and and then mm. I like I said mm. I even kind of liked the way they mm. even held themselves mm. on stage I thought that they were like an authentic and you authentic is a good word for I think they were really authentic and I think that you could tell they enjoyed what they did for sure no doubt but guys that's gonna be the end of today's Female Friday video as we always send y'all out of here we love you we thank you we appreciate you remember every single day that you wake up it is a blessing and that you are blessed and for you new people you new ones to hit the subscribe button now family members you guys have a goal every day mama remind them of that goal make somebody smile that is to make somebody smile we love y'all and we'll see y'all later